Hello, it's me again. I'm saying hello. I don't really have a lot to say right now. Um, did a paid reading, which is awesome. So now I'm a paid tarot card reader, even though I've done one paid reading and probably about fucking 40,000 non-paid readings. But yeah, I quantified it. We'll be got to work in the shop tomorrow and get some more stock in it and get it open and so it can start selling things. Talk to Inland Revenue about employing people like myself, so I can employ myself. Um, pay myself. I just paid myself today. Get myself two hundred dollars for making a website. Thought, well, that's like ten hours at twenty dollars an hour, so it's pretty reasonable. Probably spent a hell of a lot more than ten hours on that website, but you know, it's all good. And got twenty five dollars for a tarot card reading, and then PayPal took what about two dollars off it, and then I downloaded it, and PayPal took another dollar off it. So PayPal is getting it all the time. Um, so it's kind of made me realize that what you do is you take a lot of money into PayPal and then you take the whole lot down at once. So market on the books and the accountancy software is coming in and then when it actually comes in enough, stick it in the account so I'm not losing a dollar on $20 transactions. Yeah. So I pay myself 10 bucks and it's enough money to maybe get a coffee or two, which is great. It's not going to make me rich. It's not going to be a source of income yet. Bought some low Scarabeo stuff off the Kasha books, which is great. And I'm going to sell it to myself. It works on both sides. Basically, I get some good shit for 10% discount, which is what I'm giving everybody else anyway, so it's all good. And Kasha books is happy because we sell stock and we don't look like we can't do anything. So yeah, we'll just see what happens, I guess. Hmm. Haven't really got anything to talk about in these vlogs, I don't think. I don't know if vlogging is really for me. I mean, fuck all people watch anyway. And it's a weird sort of medium. I mean, when you write shit, you can just write, and if you don't like it, you can go and delete it or change it or something. But videos are forever, unless you delete them, fuck around with them. Do weird shit. I wish I could do weird shit. That would be kind of fun. I mean, flames come out of my ears or something. Um, yes. Someone asked me what pills and potions I take. Um, I take 100 mg of syrup well every night before I go to sleep to make everything quiet enough to go to sleep. I used to take a lot more than that. And one of the reasons why I weigh so much now is because antipsychotics make you put on fuckloads of weight. It's just the natural part of life. I think I gained about 60 kilos, 50 kilos in about four months. Which is a fucking a lot of weight. So yes, yay for antipsychotics. And yeah, I wouldn't say to anybody to start using antipsychotics. I mean, if you have psychosis, just fucking deal with it. It's a lot easier to deal with through meditation than it is through anything else. All antipsychotics do is turn you into a fucking zombie. Um, to tell with antidepressants, if you have depression, there are better ways to deal with depression rather than antidepressants. Because, funnily enough, one of the side effects of antidepressants is suicidal thinking. Yep, suicidal fucking thinking on an antidepressant. Take antidepressants and feel like killing yourself. <laughs> hmm. Yes. Um, also, one of the things with taking lots of antidepressants is the more you take, the more you have anxiety attacks. That's something I found out the hard way. Yeah. You take antidepressants, you have a fucking anxiety attack. You take antipsychotics, you have fucking psychosis. So, if you're taking something which is supposed to get rid of psychosis, and it's giving you worse psychosis, you're taking something that's supposed to get rid of depression, not only is it making you want to fucking kill yourself, it's giving you anxiety attacks. Hmm. Hmm, I don't think so. So what do I do now? I use mindfulness. Mindfulness meditation is incredibly, incredibly, incredibly good. Basically, you focus on the now, don't worry about the future. Don't worry about the past. I know it's fucking harder, easier said than done, because 
why? Um, well, you fucking know why. I mean, how hard is it to not think about the future? How hard is it to not think about the past? Basically, you just set your mind on the now. You need to focus on the now, be happy about what you have right now, and not sit there going, oh my god, my entire life is a fucking mess. I have no money. Because you might have no money. I know I've got fuck all money as it is. I get paid a reasonable amount of money, which is great. But then I spend it on crap. Well, not crap. I spend it on a lot of tarot cards, basically. Um, and rent and food and shit. But I kind of justify it in saying that I wasn't buying things like tarot cards, physical objects and stuff. I'd just be spending it on crap, like food or drinks or coffees. Yeah. I used to drink 35 cups of coffee a day. I was one wide little monkey. 35 cups of coffee a day at $5 a cup is, what, $175 a day on coffee? Far too much money on coffee. Where did I get that money from? I have no fucking idea. <laughs> Probably the same money way I got money for everything else. Um, yeah. So, yeah. Just rambling now. Um... Yeah, <laughs> I don't know what to say. I'm going to turn this off. See you.